We start, of course, with the latest on the deadly terror attacks in Brussels. The militant group that calls itself Islamic State has claimed responsibility for the blasts that killed more than 30 people and wounded more than 200 others. In a message written in Arabic and French on a website affiliated with ISIS, it said that uh, it had carried out the attacks as revenge for Belgium's participation in the international coalition battling Islamic State. The statement also said the attacks were merely the beginning and the consequences would be devastating. Sources quoted by Reuters say the perpetrators seem to be connected to the recently captured Salah Abdeslam, prime suspect in the Paris attacks. Now, hundreds of passengers were trying to check in at uh, Zaventem Airport at around 8 a.m. on Tuesday morning when two explosions went off in the departure hall. Another explosion struck the Malenbeek station in the city close to EU buildings. A third bomb, an undetonated suicide vest, was found at the airport and secured by bomb experts. Officials say the suspects brought three bombs into the terminal, but one failed to go off. The airport has suspended all takeoffs and landings. In a rare joint statement, heads of the 28 EU member states denounced the attacks, calling them an attack on the open democratic society. They pledged to resolutely counter terrorism.